So armed with my brand new sword, 20 health potions, and my awesome armor, we are going through and hunting scorpions today. We need to get 10 of these tell tell some things which means i need to kill at least eight more scorpions so we're on our way over there right now to do that so we're gonna go over there we're gonna start doing some slang i made up some health potions for myself i have some food for myself all in all things are looking fairly decent in that realm also i do want to try to kill some uh, spiders today as well, the tarantulas, but we're going to have to figure that out. But you guys did ask me at the end of the last episode to point out a couple of different things that I'm doing on the map. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to do a quick thank you and then we are going to move on. So first things first, where these two tarantulas are over here is right about here on the map. There's tarantulas right here. And for those of you who are wondering where that awesome viper that I fought at the end of the last video, if you have not seen that, go check that out. But where that was, was right up here here where it says snake it's actually right here this is where the viper was but anyway uh, onwards we freaking go we're gonna go back over here we're not gonna be harvesting any pyrite right now but while we're running, I do want to just throw a really, really quick thank you to everybody who's been commenting. You guys are absolutely awesome. The tips that you guys have been throwing me or just the fun banter that we've been having in the comments has really been brightening up this series for sure. I'm going to be continuing this on as long as I can. Also, really quick thanks to Jade PG, good friend of mine. Uh, met him during my grounded time and he's been making some awesome guides for this one. You guys can go check out his channels. And then also thanks to the Small Land devs and dev team. I had one one of them reach out to me do a little thank you email to me that was really really cool so thank you to you guys as well but enough with all of the niceties we are here to slay so that is what i am going to do i'm looking for a scorpion right now as soon as i find one it is on now if i remember correctly there's going to be a rhino beetle right here somewhere and that's not what i'm after i am after scorpions because i need 10 of them 10 of them? Yeah, 10. So I've already killed two. I got 20 health potions. As long as I can block properly today, I should be able to take out all of them. There's one right there. Target acquired. All right, big guy. Let's do this. Let's go. Got my new awesome sword, which I still can't block with. Oh, can't block. There it goes. And wait and block and wait and block yes let's go ah i messed up that one. Oh, i'm getting cold i'm getting hurt there it goes and Game over for you. Let's go. All right. There's another one. Fantastic. I really should have some sort of shelter. I'm going to throw down a bandage here really quick. Give myself a little bit of healing up. Um, I don't. I don't. Uh, do I have anything on me that I can build a shelter with? No, I don't. I really should have brought some stuff to build a shelter with me because I'm going to get cold and start losing health here, which is not good. Maybe I can go inside this log. I think if I go inside this log, it shelters me and makes it so I don't get as cold. So let me go inside this good old log here. There'll probably be some ladybugs in here that want to say hi, but it's okay. There we go. And comfortable. Very good. All right. We're going to let ourselves just warm up a little bit in here for a moment before we go out uh, tarantula or not tarantula hunting. Um, what is it called? Um, scorpions. Those are what they're called. That's what we're fighting here. Scorpions. All right. Where? Where? Oh, yeah, the big crevice. Yeah, you know, I didn't really want to go down here to fight scorpions, but we're going to do it anyway. There's one right there. Here we go again. Onwards to freaking victory. Hey, bud. Oh, hey, look, I ended up blocking that. Uh, all right. Nope. I really need to block those ones. Nope. Because I do not want to get poisoned. And nope. Give you a little bit more. Nope. I'm getting better at the blocking. Nope. I ended up attacking three times there. There we go. Or four. Oh, 
I didn't see the pullback because it's... Oh, God. No, 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 no. There we go. I didn't see it pull back because it was in the wall. All right. And done. All right. 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 Perfect. 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 We are getting there. I need to heal, though. I haven't had to use a single one of my health potions yet. I used a couple uh, fiber bandages, more or less. Uh, I'm starting to feel cold. Can I get covered up in here? Is this considered sheltered? In here? No, it's not. That sucks. That sucks that this isn't considered sheltered. Okay. Um, well, let's continue on at least. If I have to, I'm going to use another healing bandage because I'd rather hold on to my potions for when I really need them. That's going to be a tarantula hawk right there. And I really, really don't want to fight that. Yeah, here it comes. Well, onwards we go. I'm going to try to dodge it by just flying away. There's another... There's There we go. There's a scorpion. That's what I'm looking for. All right. Come here, you. Come here, you. I need to fight you. Come to me. What's up? There we go. Oh, I didn't block that time. Oh, crap. I'm thrown off. I'm thrown off. Hold on. There we go. Got to get back into my timing. Oh, my timing's thrown off again because he moved. Oh, no. All right. Health potion, health potion, health potion, health potion, health potion. There we go. Ah, yes. All right. All right, let me see, let me see, let me see. I have five of them now, five of them. I only need five more, which means I need five more Scorpenos. Where, oh, where am I going to find some more of them? Can I go underneath here and be covered and warm up, please? Is that a thing that I can do? Does this count? It does not, dang it. I was really hoping, but it didn't. All right, let's get another healing fiber bandage thingy going. We're gonna keep looking for more scorpions. I hate how I keep doing this at night. For some reason, I always end up doing this at night. I really wish I could fight things during the day. Maybe when I'm not freezing cold. That way I'm not constantly dying. That would be really cool. There's like not even anything down here for me to collect to build a house with. Like I can't grab, grab those, I can't grab these. I can't build mushroom houses, which, you know, I've built mushroom houses in a game before. Be cool if I could. Hmm. Maybe I'll have to run over to the Golden Temple to warm up because, well, it is starting to lighten up outside, so I should be okay. Oh, man. More scorpions, poor favor. That's a tarantula hawk, not a scorpion. That's a scorpion, though. That's what I need right there. Come here, big guy. No, no, no. I know you're scared. All right. It's all going to be okay. Just come here. Come here. Oh, messed that one up. There we go. Ah, messed that up. Ah, I got poisoned. No! Quickly heal. There we go. There we go. All right, 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 all right. That's six. I only need four more. There's one right over there. One right over there. And I'm comfortable now. Nice. That's a lot of health back. Okay, let's see. That's a tarantula hawk over there. If I fly right over here, I should be able to get to this scorpion. Just gonna throw on a healing bandage really quick, and then it is game the frick on again. Let's go! Oops. Oops. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. No, okay, not, not here we go. Okay, we're failing, we're failing fighting this guy.
There we go. He's getting your rhythm again. But you gotta get back in the rhythm. No poisons, please. No poisons, please. Oh, well, there I am poisoned. And dead. Perfect. Yes. All right. So what is that? Seven now? Yes. Three more. Three more scorpions. Oh, there's another snake down here. Cool. There's another snake down here. Okay. So if you guys are looking, there's another snake that's right in here. He's right there. If you guys want to fight that one, it's right there. Another viper for you. If you want to fight that. It's all right there for you guys to go and fight on take on if that's what you want to do. But I'm not doing that today. We're running away, because I don't have any interest in fighting another snake right now. I could use some snake leather. Honestly, I could, so I could upgrade my armor. But I just, I don't feel like fighting snakes right now. I'm on a roll with these scorpions, and I'd like to stay on the roll with these scorpions that I'm on right now. How about back here? This is, is this just another way to the snake? Is this a way around the snake? Oh, tarantula. Ooh, two tarantula. Uh, no thank you. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna keep going. Look, there's a scorpion right there. Nice. Okay. This is not exactly what I wanted to do, because now I'm being chased by tarantula. Feeling hungry and thirsty, huh? Well, I can fix that right there. Nice. All right, here we go. Another scorpion. This is number five today. Whoops, well, this is going off well to start. Oh, yeah, this is going really well to start. This is going phenomenally to start. There we go. You gonna attack or... There we go. I wish I could tame these guys. I wonder how you do that. You're all sideways and stuff now. There we go, and done. Fantastic. Hey, I've, le I've leveled up like three or four times. I really need to uh, just go through and, and get some points put in here, attribute points. All right, let's see. Get strength. Oh, I leveled twice. Strength all the way up. Um, dexterity. You know what? I'm going to bring that to 35, and then um, I'm going to bring up my endurance as much as like. There we go. All right. Very good, very good, very good. I'm getting really deadly. At this point, level 42, fast sword, fast armor. You know, I'm just, I'm moving through things really, really efficiently. There's another scorpion. We're starting to slay pretty much everything without a problem. How many scorpion things do I have? Eight. I need one more after this guy right here. Because this guy's my, my jam right here. Let's go. Oops, well. My jam until I walk up and get hit by him. All right, all right, all right. Back off, reset, back off, reset. There we go. There we go. Block him off. I'm a little bummed out all these scorpions are level one. Maybe once I get the treat to tame them, they'll start leveling up more. And punished. Very good. Yes. All right. All right. Use a regular healing bandage here. And I only need one more scorpion. No, one more. So let's go out. Let's look for him. See if we can spot one somewhere close. I only need the one. I only need the one. And once we have that one, we can go back. 
and we can start unlocking the next part, we can find this lab that they were talking about. Let's see. That's a tarantula. Tarantula. I don't need to fight any of those right now. I bet you I could kill it. Tell you what, if we get our last scorpion here, and then we are able to uh, do this little area up here, I'll try to fight a tarantula when we're done. I think that, that that's, that's a fun little thing to do. She loves got no thing on me anymore if I beat it. Although I do need this last scorpion and I'm not seeing one right now. Um. Huh. I kind of went on an exterminating spree and killed like, killed like seven of them. I killed them. Oh, 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 bad. Okay, definitely thought I was dead right there. Definitely thought I was dead. Just saying. Woo. Glad that didn't happen. Lots of salt, Peter, here. Not that I need it. Um... You really gotta watch out for that water. It'll kill you really, really quick. Oh, yes. Come to me, little friend. Come to me. Well, I mean, we're not really friends, per se. Um, a, More like work acquaintances. Oops. There we go. Perfect blocking is starting to get back into rhythm again. Kinda, kind, kind of, I'm throwing off completely here, and block, nope, there we go, there we go, there we go, all right, give me the tenth one, is that all ten, that's all ten, heck yeah, let's go! Let's go, let's go, let's go. It's time to go to the temple. Sadly, we're going to be there when it's nighttime again, because, of course, everything cool in this game has to happen in the middle of the friggin' night. But it is all good. Let's get over there. Should be right around this corner. Right? Right? Right, 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 right. No. Uh, hello? Oh, back there. Yes. Back there, that is where we want to go. That is where I want to go. Tarantula Hawk, no. Thank you. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, we're good. I need an underwater diving suit in this game. Like, I feel like there should be some sort of diving suit. I need to heal. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. I don't want to die when I'm running to do what I wanted to do since the beginning of the video. Must run over here. Okay, good. It's not chasing me anymore. Very good. Now, the only other problem we're going to have is all of the guys that want to fight me on the way up here. Now, I'm fine with doing a lot of slaying of them because they all give you hoots. And I need 500 hoots. So I have to get a lot of them. A lot, a lot, a lot of them. But for now, we'll try to avoid as many as we can, because I am excited for this. We're going to open the giant doors right there. Opening up the secret hidden temple in Grounded. I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty excited. Okay, hello, hello, hello. I have your things that you wanted. It was 10, right? Please tell me it was 10. Oh, it was only six. <laughs> oh, it was only six. Oh, it's okay. It was only six. Tribute has been accepted. Holy cool looking. How's it? Hello. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna skip. Oh, heck yes. 
Look at you! Look at you and your cool friggin' giant golden spider awesomeness that's over here. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but that's freaking cool looking. Alright, that's... That's really cool looking. Let me, let me just... There's certain times in games where you just gotta take a picture. Alright. Although your, your waterfall effect in there isn't, isn't the best. Just, just letting you know. Okay, so... Sarnak. Welcome, uh, petitioner? May the scorpion cast a shadow over you and grant you shade everlasting. Thank you. Who exactly is the scorpion? From your speech and your ignorance, I take you are the undergoer that Mimic, that Malik mentioned. A vanguard, perhaps? You have come a long way. This is the temple of the scorpion, where the supplicants from the Amber Valley travel to offer patronage. Uh, do you offer services here at the temple? I can give you access to the temple store if you have coin, but other services are reserved for the Ethereum nobility. Which services are those, may I ask? Suffice to say that a person might seek out when they have a problem that needs to be solved, discreetly and permanently. Ah, can I browse your wares? A hammer? Oh, scorpion treats! And... Scorpio laminate armor set? I want that. And also a Telson hammer. I bet you that that's, that's the one that they carry around too. But I want the scorpion treat for sure. And this armor set. I want that armor. I bet you that armor set looks really cool. All right. Talking to you again. Uh, I am following the trail of one of my compatriots. A man who had traveled to this area a very long time ago. Are you aware of any previous contact between our two people? Only as reference in ancient texts, who is this person that you may think of visit us? His name was Melkar. He was the royal apothecary at the time. Old age would have taken him long ago, but discovering his final resting place might be the key to saving your queen. A dead apothecary, you say? Why would his remains help you save your queen? Melkar is believed to have been carrying the elixir of life, which is claimed to uh, could cure any ailment. The queen has been stricken by a severe and incurable disease that is thought now to be the elixir is her only hope. Yes. It's all falling into place now. I think you should have a word with our leader, Edric. I suspect he might have knowledge about this dead apothecary you're looking for. Where can I find him? He's hard to miss, having occupied the giant's tower on the top of the ridge. Still, Edric has become more paranoid in the years. He has turned the tower into a veritable fortress bristling with defenses, and I doubt he would let you in peacefully, seeing as your uh, particular dislike towards your kind. Uh, any suggestions? Speak to Granger. Uh, he runs... A ranch in the far east, but before he turned to ranching, he worked as Edric's chief engineer. He designed the most of the defenses that are now surrounding the tower. If they have any weaknesses, he would know. All right. All right, see you later. Well, I found that lady. Now where do I have to go? Grenger's right here. All right. All right, we're going to do we're going to do the good old trick. We're going to do the quit. And then we're going to do the load trick, and then we are going to see if we can uh, if we can make it over to Grenger here really, really fast. Okay, so I just noticed, first of all, it's not winter anymore, so that's really cool. Uh, but also, we're about to talk to this Grenger guy. So here we are, where his ranch is. Uh, his ranch is right here. Um, and we're gonna run over here really quick and chit chat with him. Dude, talk about a nice looking house. What's up, buddy? Dude. You. You have a gun. All right, well, let's be nice to you. Hi there, stranger. Welcome to my ranch. What can I do for you? I was wondering if I'd ask you some questions. Uh, what is that you're holding? Uh, this is Bessie, my trusty hand cannon. Hand cannon? Yep, she spits metal balls like a little something I call fire sand. Ignited and it expands rapidly, propelling the payload at velocities that appear to exceed even the sound it produces. Sounds useful. Do you think you'd teach me how to make it? Maybe. Maybe I can. You'll have to get something. You'll have to get some things, though. We'll need two pieces of charcoal, three pieces of refined saltpeter, and one piece of refined sulfur. All right, I'll have them when I return. I'll be here. Uh, who are you? Name's Granger. Sarnak told me you might be able to help me reach Edgar. Content is not yet available. Ah. 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 Well. Saskatchewan. Uh, Edric Turrets. 
the based on a cannon I invented for him. He used them to prevent anyone from flying in his territory. I've heard the turrets are under construction now down south. Any turrets move on their own? Of course not. They require a crew of trained soldiers to aim and fire the cannon. Unmanned, they couldn't do uh, harm or fly. What are these inventions you say? They talk like, oh, I'm not anymore. I used to work for Edric, but his behavior had gotten erratic and unpredictable. I left his service and became clear. He abused my inventions for his own ends. All right. So, 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 so. Where I'm at right now is at a point where I honestly cannot go any further with the story. Okay. That's a big bummer. That's a big time bummer, but I still foresee at least, at least three more videos coming in the future. First one, which is definitely going to happen like as soon as I possibly can, is I'm going to go back, I'm going to get the stuff to come back and make boom powder, which means I'm going to make one of these guns because who does not want a freaking hand cannon in a survival game? The second thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get up enough hoots and stuff like that to start going through and getting some of the other recipes and stuff like that. I want to get the next level armor. I want to have have the flying stuff and stuff like that and then finally i do want to get the bird mount as well so we have a couple more things we still have to do oh and don't mention the fact we still have to actually build our base which we just haven't done yet so there's still plenty more to do in the future guys so thank you everybody so much for watching this one this has been absolutely phenomenal i've been having a ton of fun so i hope you guys have as well if you guys have make sure you hit that like button don't forget to subscribe leave me a comment down below and as always i'll see all of you guys in the next one